farthest that I've ever gone by myself. Good morning everyone. It is like 6.30, 6.45 a.m. and I am on my way back home. As you can see, I was kind of crying because I had to say goodbye to Wyatt for a bit. <laughs> goodbye, son. I thought since this is my first big solo travel, a bus and an Uber and two, three flights, I thought I would vlog it for you guys. We'll see how this goes. I'm definitely a little anxious. There's a lot of transportation I'm taking today. I got onto the Via Martin bus. All good to go. The bus gets there at 9 a.m. around, so I got a bus for 8.55, 9, because normally the bus gets there early. And that, because I ordered it early, I only have to pay 15 euros and some cents, which is honestly a deal. And the Uber will take me all the way to the airport. Thank goodness. Everybody, I made it to Sevilla. Very exciting. I took two connecting buses, got here earlier than expected. I was scheduled to be here at 9 a.m., but I'm here at 8.45. I'm going to my spot and get picked up by my Uber. Here we go. Definitely just walked in a circle. The pickup spot is right here at the station. And here we are. We made it in the Uber. took an uber and i scheduled it ahead of time definitely recommend if you already know around what time you need the uber and you're in a hurry because there wasn't any other ubers available at this time so scheduling it ahead was a good idea so much shorter than it was the first time so i'm taking transavia again and i'm going to paris again to the orly airport again crazy connections um so i'm basically going to two countries today paris and the u.s i'm taking transavia again and i was honestly so nervous because the transavia line was so long the last time i came but it's much shorter which is great These are what I need to get to Paris. I'm next. 
All right, I got my ticket. The lady wouldn't let me film the check-in process. But I'm gonna go through security, but you guys can't come with me. And we're back. Let's get to the gate. Gotta wait. Time to board. Bonjour. Just landed. Bonjour from Paris. Since I have to recheck in my bag every place I go, I'm off to baggage claim to claim my bag and then recheck in. <laughs> I have a flight in six hours. Yep, you heard it right, a six hour layover. Bienvenue, again. Now the question is, where's my bag? Apparently I'm belt for delivery in progress. So many suitcases. Delivery is that little bag coming my way in mine? I think it is. I thought they lost it. I'm just like that, more embarrassed. Now, how do I recheck in? I found departures this way. So apparently, I gotta go outside and around, and it is cold. At least the sun is out. Did a full 180 all the way back to the entrance. Get it? Okay. Okay, so my flight carrier is French B. I have no idea where that is. Alright, I figured out French B is in 48. Seems like it's gonna be quite a walk because I am currently at 43. And we found it. All right, so I can't check in for 25 minutes. So I'm gonna go get some new drink because I'm really thirsty and want some water. Now I'm checking my back. I just passed the check where they check to see whether you have all the documents that you need to get back to the US. Now, it is so important that right now, and right now is November 10th, 2021, you guys need not only a vaccination card, but a negative COVID test with that if you were traveling back to the US and you're a US citizen like me. I'm not sure about the rules for everyone else, but definitely if you're a US citizen, and you're traveling back to the US, you're gonna need a negative COVID test and your vaccine. And so I got that, I'm checked. You also need an attestation form, which I'll show you there. Fortunately, they seem to be giving them out at the airport, but I did it ahead of time just to save time. And it was nice, so really easy. Those are the documents you need. So it's looking like pretty much everything is do-it-yourself. Like they're literally checking in their own bags. I'm glad I got in line because this bag check system is 
getting a lot longer than I thought it was going to. I got the official. We're good to go to travel for COVID. Oh. That was stressful. I don't like do it yourself. I just like the people to do it for me. <laughs> Classic. All right, now it's off to my gate. So I'm gate F. Oh, there it is. Let's go. I'd like to say I'm doing a pretty good job. I'm at least gonna get myself to the US. All right, security time again. You know what that means. Okay, I'm out of security and now there's another check. I'm so confused, but they're being thorough. All right, I made it through the other check. I'm so ready to be in a country where I know the language. It's really hard being here and going through all the security checks and not knowing French. They're definitely ready for Christmas over here. We're in the same area as F30. I just checked my ticket and I am boarding right now. Let's go to the US of O. I was in the middle, but I gotta move over to the window seat because the person didn't show up. Customs took so long and I'm just tired. It's honestly been kind of a rough flight. Not my favorite flying alone. It's always easier to deal with the crazy travel stress when you have somebody with you, especially a partner. That's okay. I'm working on it and I'm in the US, made it through customs and now I'm gonna find a place to sleep because I can't check in for like, six hours and my flight leaves tomorrow at around eight i think going up level two ticket and check in oh, oh. <laughs> okay let's try and find a good place to sleep there literally seems like there's nobody here shops and restaurants yes
This is where oh, I'm sleeping. It has a plug in and it has space. sleep last night I did also did some work and now it's 3 30 a.m. and my flight leaves at 7 55 um, and I asked the TSA lady where the United Airlines check-in is and she says it's at terminal B which is a completely different terminal and I have to take the air train I think that's what it's called I honestly have no idea what type of transport that is maybe a tram we'll see there's the air train, and it looks like I have to pay. Seriously? Let's go. Hey. Well, this is my train. Is departing. Please hold on while the train is moving. Check in. All right, literally so empty. Apparently, we gotta go back down. We've been going all the way down. Domestic flights check in at level two. All right, I think this is my way. Cool. I had totally forgotten how easy the process is for domestic flights. You don't need to show your passport information or anything for me. Update. Totally broke down earlier because I forgot my driver's license. It's with Wyatt currently. Also, I lost my boarding pass at security because I was so stressed and I almost lost my necklace that Wyatt gave me. <sighs> it was stressful. Found the necklace, it was on the floor. The little charm was on the floor. And I got a QR code from customer service that took me to a place where I could get my QR code for my boarding pass. We're all good. <sighs> I'm going home to do is wait for my flight. You guys gotta see the sunset. Wow, this is great lighting. <laughs> Alright guys, I am about to board. Here we go. Last flight to live in Columbus and I'm I'm so close to the finish line. Take me home. Yeah. Really? Yeah. 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 Go to the airport. The biggest thing is though you made it today. And we're gonna get you over to Columbus on time and we're gonna get you there safely with the best ability we can. And just like that, we are back in Columbus. Super excited to be home. I'm gonna end the video right here. <sighs> Some takeaways from this trip was one, vlogging is really hard to do by yourself when traveling. There's so many things you have to be on top of. And two, traveling alone is way more fun with a partner, but it definitely grows you in your decision-making skills and in your ability to deal with discomfort, which is really good. So with that, I bid you adieu. If you're interested in keeping up with me and Wyatt's journeys as we try and make it to 50 countries, 
we're already four countries in make sure to subscribe and like this video see you guys later